Let's look at sperm production in detail today. When we talk about sperm production, we need to look at a few parts very carefully. We will look at the testis in detail and see how sperm production occurs there. This is the testis where all of the sperm production is happening. Once the sperms are produced from the testis, they are stored in a small part called epididymis. This here that you see is the epididymis where they are stored. From the epididymis, they are transported into the tube which then passes through the prostate, the seminal vesicles and it is ejaculated. So, it is a very complex procedure and we need to look at the testis in detail. When you magnify the testis, each testis is made up of numerous seminiferous tubules. You can see them here inside this figure and when you magnify it, this is how each tube looks like. Inside the tube is where sperm production is occurring and if we were to magnify this area inside the seminiferous tubules, you will see that uh, it is a tight tube and it is maintaining a blood testis barrier as in there is no blood inside the seminiferous tubules there is a blood testis barrier however all the hormones are passed through this uh, blood testis barrier and reach the necessary cells inside for sperm production.